Greetings, this is Earthman from EarthmanSoil.com. I hope you're having a great year so far. Uh, I hope your plants are growing huge and big. And I uh, hope they're giving glory to God. And um, if you're growing organic, I hope your soil is alive. Yes, alive. You need living soil in order to grow organic, true organic, without using liquid organic fertilizers. Um, instead, using minerals and whatnot in your soil, and the microbes break it down, and the mycorrhizal and the microbes bring it to the roots and feed it. Yum, yum, yum. And your plant gets big and huge, not to mention all the amino acids and humic acids and everything else that the living organisms do for your plant and soil structure. Okay, what am I doing here? I am about to make another batch. I'm always busy making new batches of my, uh, my this is my own personal IMO, which is incorporated into um, my Grovana OS um, inoculated uh, IMO three form um, inoculant and um, uh, I just want to let you know I have a new product a couple new products coming out soon but um, it's something I forgot to mention that's in my products um, I do put amino acids in my products uh, all amino acids that are uh, vegetable based not animal based uh, amino acids um, and I uh, just want to throw that out, but I have a new product coming out. It's going to be Grovana OS Liquid, and it's going to be uh, all, everything that's in this. Uh, if you go on my website and look at all the different microbes and biostimulants that are going to be in there, um, that'll be in the liquid, uh, and it's going to be easier to use, and all you basically do is you measure it out into uh, a bucket with some water um, accordingly to its directions, and you you know bubble it for about 24 hours, maybe less. Hey, less is actually better, about 18 hours. And then you apply that to your plant, and boom, they're inoculated. And all the fabulous biostimulants that are in our product uh, are incorporated into that too. And so, um, so I'm making a. Uh, let's get back to what I'm doing here, and and you could do the same thing. Um, what you do is you get a different. Uh, what's in here is different. Uh, uh, microorganism sources, I guess you can say. There's different earthworm castings in there. There's um, different soil from uh, places I've been in New York and in other states where it's very rich in uh, living soil, nice and fluffy in forest and uh, under trees, on top of hills, uh, at the bottom of hills, and wherever I can get rich soil, sources of soil and um, and I, I also put my own Grovana in there just to uh, kickstart it. And um, uh, it's just going to be a whole host of different organisms. And that's just one of the ingredients that's in Grovana is my own personal IMOs that I also incorporate into the mix along with all the other targeted growth promoting bacteria and fungi and biostimulants. Um, and so it's amazing, incredible product, fresh, handmade by me, Earthman Soil Master. <laughs> I guess I just gave myself that title, Soil Master. But um, yeah, but I do know a lot about soil and the science of it and plants and what they do and how they react with biostimulants that are applied, biostimulants like humic and fulvic acid, seaweed extracts, and the different types of seaweed you can use. I have a secret... Uh, supply of a secret to kelp that I use that it's just amazing that puts me head and tails above everybody else's uh, liquid kelp stuff um, as it pertains to biostimulants so but you get uh, all these different soils from wherever and some earthworm castings and you know some leaf mold maybe some uh, you know you get you go to your leaf pile and get some gray leaf mold put that in there and then you, you take some cooked rice you put it in there and you let it sit and then what happens is uh, white I'll show you I'll, I'll do another video but a uh, white microcellum be covering this and then you would just uh, this is probably about um, three cups of uh, rice in there I'll mix it with three cups of brown organic brown sugar sometimes I use molasses but in this case I'm gonna use brown sugar and um, and that's your IMO too and uh, once you have uh, IMO2, you let that sit for uh, like a week or two, and then you you uh, put it and make a tea with it. Real, you know, uh, you know, put some of that 
IMO2 in there, and you can make mix that with wheat bran, make your own IMO3. There you go. And then from wheat, IMO3, you can make IMO4, which is when you mix it with uh, a pile of compost. Um, and, and, you know, just look into it, do your homework. But uh, here at Earthman Soil, we have uh, so many uh, microbes, and nobody can give you these microbes because these are my personal microbes that I have collected that I believe will make your plant just amazing. I mean, the bricks level will be off the chart. So I'm going to end this incredibly long video. May God bless you. And don't forget to visit our website. At this time, we have some uh, deals. Uh, you buy two of anything, you get one pack of Root Love Science for free. And don't forget, down the road, we are going to have a new product, Grovana OS Liquid. It's going to be amazing. May God bless you this day. 